What the? Uh, can I help you with something? This is my house. Who are you? This isn't your house. Yeah, it is! Uh, maybe it was at one time, but you abandoned it. Probably shouldn't have done that. I didn't abandon it. I was gone for the weekend. Where'd you go? Branson. Oh, how was it? It was very nice. That's not the issue right now. Uh, sure it is. <laughs> you go someplace nice like that. I mean, why would anybody want to come back to a rancid plot like this? Rancid plot? That is a misnomer. What are you doing here? I'm squatting. It's pretty obvious. No, it is not obvious. If anything, you're standing, or cowering behind a door in any case. Oh, no, 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 no. I mean, like, squatting, as in living in an abandoned house. I can't say I'm familiar with that word. I don't much care for puns. This place is not abandoned. I have returned. So I'm gonna need you to leave. Yeah, uh, let's... I got plans, man. Plans? You have plans? <laughs> Let me in! Oh, so that's it, huh? Just gonna live it up from now on, in my house! Safely shielded by your legal double entendres. Well, two can play at that game, mister! <laughs> So let me get this straight. You come home from a weekend in Branson and find your house occupied by a squatter, and you, being unfamiliar with the term squatting, think that you're being victimized by a pun in our legal system. So you've decided to fight fire with fire and use a pun against the squatter, asking us brewery workers to go find the squatter, retrieve him, bring him to the brewery, and thus, to use your words, give him the hops? Is this basically what you're saying to me? That is absolutely correct. I tried that thing at the brewery, you know, where they would give you the hops. They didn't go for it. Too bad. I would have been clever. Yeah. But listen. Yeah, I'm just calling the cops. Oh, man. No. You don't want to do that. It'd just be your word against mine. What you want to do is go right to a lawyer. Yeah. These guys are the real estate experts. I guess that makes sense. Wait a minute, I recognize these guys. Yeah, they handled the contract when I bought this place. So they'll know that the house is mine. But why would you give this? It's so degrading. See, my problem is, I came home to find my house occupied by a squatter. A squatter? I just need to know the legal process for getting him out. Sure, sure. There isn't any. I'm sorry, what? Well, Jack. There have been a lot of changes in the laws regarding these types of matters recently, what with the housing market being the way that it is. Now squatting is totally legal, and if someone takes your home while you're away, well, possession is nine-tenths, etc. May I suggest a treehouse? I don't believe this. That's a chance that you take when you leave your house, Jack. Who says there's no gambling in Branson, huh? <laughs> wait, 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 excuse me. How did you know that I was in Branson? What? I didn't. Branson? I don't believe I'm familiar with that term. <laughs> and you see, Florence, that's what fair on its face is. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, that's super handsome. What are you doing here? I'm the paralegal. What happened to my house? You don't realize your own fortune, Jack. You are the witness to the dawning of a new era. This was your house, yes. The Pinkerton Law Office is squatting in your house, which is legal according to the Pinkerton Law Office. And the Pinkerton Law Office can say this because it is an established presence in your house. The law is right because the law says it is right. Do you see what I have accomplished? I have made the law infinitely self-verifying. If you wish to go home, you must go to the law. But if you go to the law, you must go home. This is our world now, Jack. The law is right, because the law says it is right. I'm the paralegal. Don't use that door. Oh, great.
there. Who are you? Me? I am Steve Pinkerton, proprietor of this law office. And you must be Jack. What is your office doing in my home? Or my home in your office? I don't understand it any better than you do. It was my intern's idea to take over the whole house. It sounded a bit screwy to me, but he said, no, it's MC Escher meets Richard M. Nixon. We need to do something radical to keep up with social networking. <laughs> uh, so stupid. But why are you in my basement? Oh, I've always been here. One way or another, there's a lawyer in every house. They need us just as much as we need them. <laughs> oh boy, now I'm starting to sound like that screwball upstairs. Could you get the hell out? Sure thing. So let me make sure I got this. You set up a law firm in a stranger's house just so you could figure out some sort of strange loop scenario where you could legally squat in this person's house because you were squatting in someone's house. And then you realize this is stupid, so you left. And now you want to squat in our brewery because being moved from one place to another, you've been given the hops, which you take to be a legal pun that you can exploit to your own benefit. Yes, and remember, I am a lawyer. Fine.